I uploaded a video yesterday analysing the supposed so-called knockdown that Pulley Man and RG suffered in sparring against Conor McGregor. And I slowed the video down as you saw and it becomes very clear that Pauli Malinaji did not get hit prior to hitting the ground. He was pushed down, but no actual punches landed in that sequence that he ended up in which he ended up on the floor. Now, somebody posted this in my group after I'd already uploaded that video, and it's tweets from Pauli Malinaji confirming exactly what I said. Remember, I didn't hear this from Malinaji. I saw it with my own eyes and you should have seen it with your own eyes if you have any kind of objectivity to you at all. McGregor never hit Paulie in that particular sequence. So how can you, it be called a knockdown when he never landed any punches? <laughs> Paulie says, yeah, watch how he overshoot the left. That's why it winds up behind my neck to begin. Literally not one punch lands in the exchange. Facts. Willie Costa Jr. says, at Dana White, very smart man, you brought in Pauli Malinaji, uh, you brought Pauli Malinaji in just to get pics and video of him falling down. 36 minutes and all you have is 25 seconds. And then Pauli goes on to say, let them have their 35 seconds, they know what happened last week. So on and so forth. So, what Pauli's saying here is the truth. Whether they're silly, deranged, emotional, McGregor fanboys want to believe it or not is up to them. <laughs> they, they are what they are. I had to deal with the idiotic Mayweather fanatics a few days ago and now I've got to deal with the idiotic McGregor fanatics. <laughs> and probably, you know, when I was doing the Floyd videos, there was some of these idiotic McGregor fanatics who would have saw the Floyd videos and been cheering me on. Yeah, go get him. Let's subscribe to this guy. He's going to be bashing Floyd all the time, which automatically means he's going to be supporting McGregor. This is the mind of the fanboy. This is how they think. When, lo and behold, they got the shock of their life when I uploaded a video yesterday questioning the veracity, actually proving that the knockdown that McGregor's claiming he scored over Malinaji and sparring was not a knockdown at all. They must, the McGregor fanboys must have been horrified. I'm unsubscribing. This guy's supposed to be bashing Mayweather and supporting McGregor. Why is he supporting Mayweather now by default? They're confused. Well, I'm not supporting Mayweather and I'm not supporting McGregor. I'm supporting the facts. I'm supporting the truth. That's what I'm supporting. And when you take that type of neutral stance, you're going to upset everybody. <laughs> that is the, that's the path I chose on YouTube. I have chosen the path where everybody is going to attack me at some point or another. I have been attacked by the fans of just about every major fighter you could think of. From Canelo fans, to Golovkin fans, from Mayweather fans, to Kovalev fans, Klitschko fans, Joshua fans. Like, every set of fans, Kell Brook fans, Khan fans, every set of fans of all the major fighters pretty much have attacked me and accused me of being a hater of their fighter at one point or another. And that will continue because I take a neutral stance, because I follow the truth. Because on my channel, my motto is, was, and always will be, no fighter is below praise and no fighter is above criticism. So these little girls running around screaming like <laughs> teenagers about uh, McGregor, he wasn't knocked down and all this foolishness. No, it wasn't. You thought you'd come to a channel where what? I'm going to be bashing Mayweather and supporting McGregor. Is that what you thought? It's not that kind of party. <laughs> Your fighter is not off limits from my critical analysis. No fighter is on this channel. None of them are off limits from my critical analysis. And that's all it is. It's not even McGregor hating. It's just a critical analysis of that video footage. And I came to the only conclusion you could come to if you've got a working brain and a pair of working eyes, that there was no knockdown. There was no legitimate knockdown in that sparring footage. It was a pushdown. Facts. <laughs> People want to get upset about that and scream and cry like little girls. Be my guest. It's all good. <laughs> Foolishness. So there you go, people. Let me know what you think in the comment section below. Rage if you must. 
And the sensible people will be nodding their heads in agreement. <laughs> Let me know what you think in the comment section. Uh, yeah, if you haven't done so already, make sure you click the notification bell below this video. It should be next to the subscribe button. And also take a look at this smorgasbord, which should be appearing on screen right now or in just a few seconds. A selection of four other videos I've recorded recently. You might want to go have a look at them if you haven't watched those videos before now. All right, so go have a look at those. Give me a thumbs up. Give me a thumbs down. Give me a favorite. Give me a share. Whatever the case may be, busy yourself. All right, it's happening. I'm out.